I created this map to talk about gas with respect to the two ways into the Rubicon uh, from the Loon side. So you can come in Georgetown, which you would you would drop in on 49 at Auburn, come into Georgetown. That's your last gas and groceries as you go down Wentworth to go to Loon. Um, it's about an hour and 15 minutes from Georgetown. And it's about uh, uh, about seven miles from Loon as you're going up Ice House. There's a point when Ice House goes right and Wentworth kind of goes straight. And I've, I've even made this mistake, especially at night, where I just keep driving straight and you end up way off. So you got to really watch that Wentworth Ice House turn to make sure you hang kind of towards the right to go up Loon. Um, Sly Park is really your last groceries. There's a, there's a Safeway there. Fresh Pond is your last like gas that's going to be open late. Ice House Resort on Ice House Road does sell gas, but they do close, I don't know, the summertime, maybe 7 o'clock, maybe later. You, you kind of have to call them to see what their availability is. They do have food there. They do have a restaurant there. Um, Ice House is a steep grade and takes about 45 minutes from Highway 50 to Loon for me in an old, tired XJ. So uh, maybe even in my JL too. So keep that in mind. So give you a rough idea of how long it takes to go the two routes. You know, I used Placerville as a as a point of reference. Um, you can see that the drive times from Placerville to the two ways in is very similar on that version of Google Maps. And I hope that helps some folks out. Uncle Tom's is somewhere probably around here. Um, the chalet is a left turn before you make the first dam up here for parking. I think Ice House Resort might let you pay for tow rig parking, but I'm not sure. Also, too... Uh, in South Lake Tahoe, there's a lot of pay campgrounds that you can actually pay to leave your tow rig and trailer, and you can park in the back. So check that out. Call some of those campgrounds out in this area. I've had friends do that before as well, and hopefully that helps some folks out getting uh, planning their Rubicon trip.